Riverbank is the shortest song on the album. It was originally going to be the intro to the album until we wrote Dog Heart. I think this song is definitely a, a lyrical one. Yeah. Until I mean, the end. Yeah, until the end. That part's really exciting. Montana fought forever to have that saxophone at the end of the song with that strong melody. Um, the ba da 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 ba da 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 And we kept fighting them on it, and then finally we did it. It just sounds awesome. Yeah, it sounds... It's yeah. so cool. It's honestly what makes that part. It'd be really boring. <laughs> yeah, without that sax, it seriously makes it. It's interesting, though, because playing that, the, that low note that really honks, that da 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 is actually lower than <laughs> you can possibly play on the saxophone. <laughs> so, <Good. laughs> so, you know, little Pro Tools magic fix that, but... <laughs> Sounds great. Sounds, sounds great. Sounds yeah, great. thank you, everyone. Sounds really so good. Nice. Um, this is actually the first song that we ever finished for the self-titled album. I was really pumped when I first heard it. I was like, man, that's a great opening no. song. No, it's yeah, it's a great song. I think it really sets the mood for I Could Do Better. It does. Yeah, it, it really brings it It brings it all back in after, because yeah. it's after Call It Home, right? Yeah, exactly. And so it brings the energy back up. Mm-hmm. 